Ah, so gym. Yeah. Are you are you into gym quite a lot now at the moment? Heavy. Yeah. Heavy. Heavy. How many, heavy. How many times a week? All right. So it's between four and six. Damn. Yeah, between four and six. If I can make the six, it's six. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like Monday to Saturday, Sun- no, Sunday. It depends off. on the, you know, the work and the shift and them things. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but um, yeah, yeah, I love it, man. Okay, how many how many hours in the gym? Two and a half to three. A day? Yeah. yeah, yeah. What are you doing in there? <laughs> <laughs> weights and cardio, man. Yeah. All right, so talk talk me through like uh, what weights first or cardio first? I should charge people for this, you know. <laughs> but, um, You'll get some clients, man. That's cool. <laughs> I, split, I split it. Yeah. So I like to do 50 minutes each session, but I split the 50 minutes of cardio. Mm. So I'll do five minutes to warm up, get the blood going on the... Should I tell the actual detail? Yeah, man. <laughs> Sorry, man. If you, if you become a PT, people come to you yeah. for more information. Five minutes on the cross trainer. Mm. Five minutes on the back, that's 10 minutes already. The blood's going. Okay. Weights. Warm up, yeah. Yeah. Then I'll do five minutes on the Stairmaster. And then weights again. And then 30 minutes on the running machine. Oh, so on you're actually alternating time. between, between yeah. weights and cardio? So I'm constantly warm. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Because um, I don't want to just do 50 minutes and then weights. Mm. I like to split it up because I've still done the 50 minutes of cardio. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Because I don't like cardio. But I know I have to. I do hear it. you. Yeah yeah. yeah, yeah. I have to. My body type. I have to, bro. Yeah. I look at a cookie. It's coming on. I'm, I'm the same. The weight, I'm the, the same. Yeah. Flying on, bro. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? So, but yeah, gym's a passion, bro. I love gym. How, how long have you been going gym? Since the breakup thing. You know what I'm <laughs> Actually, I'm lying. Now, before then, do you know what? My boy Samuel from school. Yeah. Um, he was like, "Yo, do you want to come gym?" I was, I was 13. Oh. And it was Wavelengths gym. And um, yeah, I was like, "Yeah, fuck it. I want to get wham." Deptford. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, so yeah. from 13, but I weren't serious. We weren't serious. Yeah. I remember one time we, <laughs> we was like, yeah, do you know what? We're going we're gonna to lose the weight, me and my boy. We were both chubby at the time. Yeah, you come in gym, yeah? All right, cool. We would pull up to the gym. We get in the locker room and we sit there. And we're like, do you want to skip it today? We skipped it, sat outside the gym, got patty and cocoa bread and a nourishment. <laughs> and ate it outside the gym. The worst combination you could ever... <clears throat> a patty and cocoa bread and a nourishment. Starchy and we're talking carbs, the day dude. before about how we're going to be on this gym thing. And yeah. we ate it outside the gym. <laughs> Didn't go, but yeah. So um, we wasn't serious, but... Yeah. I don't think gym is a thing where you're serious straight away. I think it, you, you get into it. Do you know what I mean? Mm. But yeah, since, since I was 13. Nice. And serious after the instance with the girl. <laughs> <laughs> and then from then it just got serious, yeah. But do you feel like you you understood everything in gym or do you feel like, you know, re- recently you kind of understood, you know, this is what I actually need to do? No, nah, man, you, you learn as you go along. Mm. Um, you first go there, you're just kind of dabbling and winging it. And then, you know, you go to YouTube, you go to the people that give you the shit advice, you try that, you fuck up. Um, like you're guaranteed to fuck up at least once or twice, bro. Do you mm. know what I mean? Um, yeah. I've gone on, like, when the first thing with the breakup with the girl, I did too much cardio and I just got sucked, bro. Like, I got skinny, I lost all the muscle. Mm. Um, because I wasn't aware of protein intake. You're still meant to be lifting heavy while you're in a caloric deficit. Yep. All these things I wasn't aware of. But you learn, you have to go through these stages to actually get the knowledge to improve, do you know what I mean? Yeah. It's a, it's a lifelong journey because you're always learning. There's no Don that's a master at the gym. I don't care what these influencers say, bro. There's no master at the gym. Yeah. You're always learning. Yeah, definitely. PTs are learning. Influencers are learning. I'm still learning. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. And you've got to learn your own body as well. Yeah. yeah. And there's no one that you can't learn from. Don't ever look at someone's physique or whatever and think, I can't learn from them. There might be a Don that was a cyclist and he can help you on certain tips when it comes to cardio, how he, how he, he works on his endurance. Then there could be a brother that's super wham that helped. He could teach you how he ended up being able to lift what he lifts. Like there's no person that you can't learn from. Everyone's got their angle that they they might be better at you at. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, um, definitely. Yeah. All right. So yeah. in your in your latest single, the voice, yeah. Yeah. We said I was a fat kid with big dreams and charisma. Yeah. <laughs> bubble. What was it? Bubble gum and bubble butts. And bubble butts. I was, I was into. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Bro, at that time, yeah. When I, when I was a fat youth, I yeah. was still slightly confident when the things, I can't lie. 
And at that age, all I cared about was music and pussy in that order. <laughs> That's all I cared about. Yeah. Bars and going to bars to get girls. That's it. That's fair enough. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Um, music yeah. and girls. You ever rap to a girl? Rap to a girl? Nah. <laughs> nah, nah or nah, sing. Nah. Sing me sing to a girl. <laughs> Yeah, that's why they're laughing. <laughs> Recent, nah, 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 that's not happening. Nah, nah, nah. Oh, fair enough, fair enough. What well, have you? Nah, uh, <laughs> that was good. Nah, my, my, my friend's uni, uh, he, he had a friend who used to sit, like serenade a girl, bro. Panty dropper? Yeah. Is that yeah. what it's called? No, nah, I'm asking you, is it a panty dropper? It was his girlfriend. Oh, okay. So, so it was, yeah, okay. but she was into it, so. Okay, I, I'm always saying that. <laughs> yeah, so I can sing, but I can hold a note, but I'm not the type to be. Singing to a girl, no, 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 fair enough, fair enough. <laughs> Can we expect more gym content then on the Insta? Yeah, man. Um, started a YouTube channel. Nice, it's yeah. It's like another um, outlet to just express myself. Um, it's like kind of vlog style. Uh, yeah, I just give advice. I talk about different topics while I'm working out. Mm. Just started it, so I'm just trying to build it up and that. But yeah, man. You, yeah. you done YouTube before? Or? Nah. Oh, I mean, only for music, of course. Yeah, yeah. only for music. Never yeah. done it for like gym or anything else like that yeah so yeah no, that's good man that's yeah, good definitely yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah with with the body you had a body transformation then would you say or? Mm. yeah yeah i've had a few though but my latest one i put online but um lockdown <sighs> Jeez. was lockdown good for you no it finished me that was bad absolutely okay finished me, bro. yeah like i got bare fat yeah because i wasn't used to that like I'm used to having access to a gym. Mm. So when they're saying gyms are closed, I, I just didn't know how to function after that. Like, I just thought, fuck it at that point. Um, and yeah, I ended up gaining bare weight, man. How much you put on? Uh, probably about 35 pounds, 40 pounds. Uh, yeah. Kilograms, that's maybe about... 15 kg, 10, 15 kg. It's quite a bit, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. A lot, bro. Yeah. A lot. But I always knew, like, I have this thing in me that I knew, like, it's not staying on. Yeah. I knew once the gyms are open, I'll get it together. That's so, good, yeah. Yeah, because <laughs> I'd done it before. Oh, okay, I see. You know how. Yeah, yeah. This is what I say to people, like, it's a skill set to be able to lose weight. That's a skill set. Like, having mm. a, um, knowing another language, all of that is the same thing. If you go to the average person on the road and you tell them, yeah, go and drop 10 pounds, go on a cut, do this, lose body fat and keep your muscle, they wouldn't really know how to do that. Mm. So I'm saying when you develop that skill, that's a good thing in your arsenal to have. So when situations like that happen, you know how to rectify it. Do you know what I mean? You're yeah. not having to then go on YouTube and scramble and how do I do this? You know it, you've done it before. Do you know what I mean? It's that muscle memory. So talking about the gym, do you think that your body has to reach a certain stage or yeah, before or a certain look before you can start posting content? Oh, that's a sick question. Um, yeah. Yeah? In, today, in today's society, yeah. I think the standards have gone through the roof. Um, but we don't have to. Um, a lot of the people that are influencers now, you don't know what they're doing and what they're taking and what angles they're doing because mm. a lot of shit is lighting. A lot of these men are taking drugs and they're posting that they're natural. So you feel this pressure to have to look a certain way. So I kind of want to flip that. Like, don't get me wrong, I feel like I look good. But to the standards that are out there, people would say, no, no, you don't. But I don't care. I'm showing an example of a natural good physique. Do you know what I mean? Um, this is a realistic goal that you can hit. Now, a lot of things come down to your genetics as well. I feel like I have really good genetics. Mm. So that plays a part in it. So to answer your question, yeah, there's a pressure, man. Um, even me, I feel like, mm, should I post this? Do I, look, do I look good enough to post this? Are people going to recognise that this is a good physique? But I just think, fuck it, man. I think I look good. So, you know what I mean? So, yeah. But to answer your question, yeah. Yeah. I think you do need to look a certain way, but I'm trying to fight against that. I think as long as you are <coughs> above average, yeah. someone's going to look at you like, okay, cool, that's attainable. Let me follow this guy. There are influencers out there that are overweight. Yeah. Because if you think about it, their influence is to other people that are overweight. If this guy's trying, I can try. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? So, yes and no. 
kind of went back on my question there. Yes and no, but for me, I know I want to look a certain way. Do you know what I mean? But there's, that's not to say that if you're overweight, you can't be an influencer. So it's about kind of confidence in yourself. Confidence in yourself, man. Because I can't lie, I've seen a couple of gym people and they're not, they're not up to gym standard. Like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? But, they, but they, they, they post. Yeah. But what's gym standard? That's subjective, mm. right? Mm. So it goes back. Gym standard is subjective. True. Because to the person that's bed bound, you know, then like my 600 pound life, you've not seen that. <laughs> Them brothers there, they'll look at that guy yeah. that's trying in the gym as raw. I'd like to be able to just get to that stage to yeah. be able to go to the gym. So everyone's an influencer to someone. Mm. Do you see what I'm saying? That's good. Yeah, it's a good yeah, way of looking yeah. at it still. So there's yeah. just levels to it. My level was just like, hi, I just wanna I'm obviously not Simeon Panda in the man, but <laughs> <laughs> do you know what I mean? I could always try my bro. Yeah, yeah. 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 <clears throat> so you say more more gym, more girl? More gym, more girls. <laughs> yeah. Um, yes and no. Mm. So on the front end you get a lot of sex. The front end, yeah. On the front end you get a lot of sex, yeah. Mm. But um if you ain't got no substance to you, that's all you're gonna get. Mm. That's all you're gonna get is, <laughs> is the sex. You need to have something else about you, bro. Cause it's easy for a thing to get a gym guy. That's easy for them. Yeah. It's nothing. You can get that in 15 minutes. What else do you have about you? Mm. Do you see what I'm saying? What else sets you apart from the other gym guy? You're just another in shape guy. Yeah. So yeah, on the front end, you get a lot of quick hookups and shit, mm. but you need more to you, man. Yeah, some substance. You need more to you, bro. Yeah. 